All right, 9B. Okay, now what I like about the, the first couple questions here is that most of the factoring has been done for us here. And so, actually what I'm gonna do here is I'm just going to investigate this. Uh, multiplication, as we stated before here, uh, if I simply write these factors just up against each other like this, so I take all the factors in the numerator and just string them together, I mean, essentially that's what that multiplication is. Like, the fact that this is x plus two times x minus three times, and I keep going, uh, there's, there's really no reason to put that uh, multiplication sign right there other than to split this up. The denominator is gonna simply become this, Maybe I'll put the 2x in brackets there just to, to kind of hold it together. And so now, anything that I see in the numerator, basically anything that I see in the numerator of either term uh, or either, either factor here, okay, will cancel with, with anything that you see in, in the denominator and of either factor there. So I've got this uh, 7x, okay? Now, I'm gonna, I'll deal with the numbers later on here, but first of all, there's a factor of x here all by itself. There's a factor of x right there as well. It's not being added or subtracted. Those will go away so long as we state, sorry, I don't know why I put a semicolon there, so long as we state that x cannot equal zero. Uh, the x plus two doesn't have a, a partner in the denominator, so it stays. x minus three though does, and that'll go away so long as we state that x is not allowed to equal three. I've got two x plus seven factors in the numerator. It's being squared there and one in the denominator. So the square goes away, but that factor goes away so long as we state that x is not allowed to equal negative seven. x minus seven has a partner in the denominator and that will go away so long as we state that x cannot equal positive seven. Now in terms of uh, numeric values, what we're left with here, I've got a seven over a 21. They share a factor and that's gonna leave me a three in the denominator. Now, what I've got left over, I've got an x plus two and an x plus seven in the numerator, that's it. And in the denominator, I've got a three and a two. So, and that's, remember, that's all being multiplied together. Don't, they're not added, they're being multiplied. Okay, we're, we're canceling factors and what you're left with is things that are being multiplied together. And there you go. Now, I could expand that, but it, it's not gonna do me any good. Uh, if you feel the need to expand that just because you prefer the form, that's fine. But I mean, we're not gonna be able to then cancel anything here, so it's, it's fine just to leave it like that.